In the book, An Original Interpretation of the Apocalypse, the image of the beast was Dagon in his mother's arms. The mother began to be worshipped along with the child. She was given all the attributes of the child. Isis worship was one of the biggest competitors to the early church. A great and solemn procession was then formed, headed by Marduk on his chariot glittering with gold and precious stones, and led by the king. It went down Procession Street across Babylon in an order of incense, songs, and music, while people were kneeling down in adoration as it passed by. Through Ishtar Gate, the procession left the city, and after a short journey on the Euphrates, reached the Bid Akitu, a temple filled with plants and flowers, in the middle of a large park. So in ancient Babylon, on the banks of the Euphrates, on the night of the solstice, summer solstice, um, there's a ceremony where while the music is playing, a statue is taken down to the Euphrates River and it's washed thoroughly in the river, primarily the mouth. At that point, the statue comes to life and it's led by the hand to the throne where it sits. Da-da-da-da. 